let's get to Boulder, where the King Supers mass shooting trial continues today. Starts at 9 o'clock this morning. Yeah, just a couple hours from now, the defense is trying to prove the suspect's mental illness kept him from knowing right from wrong the day of the shooting. Fox 31's Lisa D'Souza here in studio with the latest. Good morning. So we are now more than two weeks into this trial. Of course, it has been three years since 10 people were killed at that grocery store off Table Mesa Drive in Boulder. Right now, the defense is trying to prove the suspect's schizophrenia was too severe for him to be considered sane. The state arguing he made many deliberate decisions like buying guns and other research before the shootings. Among the latest to testify, the suspect's father and sister, along with the state psychologist. That psychologist saying the suspect initially refused to attend group treatment sessions while at a state psychiatric hospital in the wake of the shootings. His father claiming his son was a typical kid growing up until a few years after high school. That's when he said he started to withdraw and become isolated. Also saying he did not receive treatment for his mental health, despite his condition worsening during the pandemic, loved ones say. Speaking through a translator, family members say he thought he was being watched, followed, and often laughing for no apparent reason. Very difficult to engage him for even a half hour state psychologist you just heard from there. Now, as the defense continues on, the jury will soon again have to decide if the suspect was competent enough to know the consequences of his actions that day. This all gets back underway here at nine o'clock. And of course, we'll be on it bringing you the very latest. Drew and Andrea. All right. We'll check back in throughout the morning. Of course, we're covering every day of this trial for you here on Fox. Thank you, Lisa.